today, I am going to discuss to you the Greek mathematicians, their bibliography, and their contributions to mathematics. First, we have Euclid. Euclid is sometimes called Euclid of Alexandria to distinguish him from Euclid of Megara. He was a Greek mathematician, often referred to the father of geometry or the father of geometry. He is also the founder of the 13 books of elements. Next, we have Archimedes. Archimedes is considered the father of mathematics. Why? Because of his notable inventions to mathematics and science. He developed many inventions, and one of those is to calculate the measurement of a circle. Another one, we have Plato. Plato was one of the ancient Greeks' most important patrons of mathematics. He was best known for his identification of five regular symmetrical three-dimensional shapes. Next, we have Hippocrates. Hippocrates is a Greek mathematician, geometer, and astronomer. He was the first to write the symmetrically organized geometry textbook called The Elements, and it was his major The Great Geometer. His works had a very great influence to the development of mathematics and his famous book on here. It introduced the terms parabola, ellipse, and hyperbole. Lastly, we have Thales. Thales has been credited with the discovery of Bisected by its diameter. Second, the angles in a triangle opposite two sides of equal length are equal. Third, the opposite angles formed by intersecting straight lines are equal. Fourth, that the angle inscribed inside a semicircle is a right angle. Fifth, that a triangle is determined if its base and the two angles at the base are given. That's all for today.